Welcome to Watch Mojo UK, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Gangs of London moments. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we'll be going over the most surprising, exciting and just plain cool moments from the first series of Gangster Show Gangs of London. Naturally, there will be spoilers for the entire first series. If there's a Gangs of London moment you can't believe we forgot, try not to flame us in the comments. Number 10. The Death of Finn Wallace Gangs of London begins with a murder. A Welsh traveller boy named Darren is contacted about a job where he's instructed to hide in Albanian territory to kill a supposed offender. It's a tense scene, as Darren psychs himself up and his friend Johan waits outside in the car, the latter getting harassed by a local gang. However, when a posh car pulls up, Johan realises something is horribly wrong. The man who steps out is Finn Wallace, London's biggest crime boss. Keep it rolling, Jack. Despite Johan's attempts to call and stop Darren, the kid kills Wallace. Not only is it a suspenseful scene, but it also acts as the spark that leads to nearly every other moment on our list and most in the show. <laughs> Number 9. Elliot vs Len the Butcher Elliot Finch is an undercover cop and an enforcer in the Wallace organisation. To win favour with the Wallaces, Elliot has his police connections track down Darren's whereabouts after he goes into hiding. Unfortunately, the boy is gone and he's faced with Len, an associate of Darren's father. When he loses his gun, Elliot must overcome the massive cleaver-wielding man who's dressed only in his pants with his bare hands. The entire fight pulses with danger throughout, as Len pursues Elliot relentlessly. While Elliot cleverly uses the environment and Len's own weapon to his advantage, he never feels out of danger. Not until Len's throat is cut, at least. The whole fight is basically Gangs of London doing its take on a horror movie. <laughs> Number 8. Marion and Ed's Graveside Chat The first series finale sees everything falling apart. Marion Wallace meets with Ed Dumani in a graveyard. Ed is under pressure from the Wallace organization's mysterious investors to kill Finn and Marion's son, Sean, who has blown up one of their buildings and shot Ed. Give me time. I'll get him away from London. He shot me, Marion. He wants Marion to give up her boy or his own son Alex will die. They both lament that it has come to this and that Finn's actions have torn their family apart. How did we get here? Finn. Each also draws a gun on the other. Eventually, the choir of voices at the nearby funeral swells, a helicopter passes overhead and Ed shoots Marion. It's one of the more artful and tragic scenes in the series, though it may not be the last of Marion. Number 7. Elliot vs Cole After Sean has rogue gang leader Lala's sister and her family abducted, Elliot goes to get them back. Their kidnapper is Cole, a sadistic, axe-wielding psychopath. After urging her and the children to run, Elliot goes head-to-head -head with Cole. <laughs> It's a spectacular battle, with plenty of longer takes and dynamic camera movement that follows their movements in many directions, some of director and series creator Gareth Evans' trademarks. Unfortunately, Cole proves too much for Elliot and overpowers him. <laughs> Things look grim for the cowering family, but luckily, Ed arrives just in time to shoot Cole. This fight is yet another fantastic one from Elliot, though it's not quite his best so far. Number 6. Luan Takes Down Morsi Leader of London's Albanian gang, Luan Dusage has a rough go of things. Firstly, he's falsely suspected of being involved in Finn Wallace's death. Then he lands himself in hot water with Nigerian gangster Morsi. After a failed ambush on Morsi, Luan is captured. Luan's fear is palpable as the man who betrayed him is butchered with machetes. 
However, when Muzzy threatens his family, Luan breaks free of his captor, claims a machete of his own, and goes full savage on Muzzy and his men. <laughs> He cuts through the terrifying gangsters in short order and even puts out Mosey's eyes. It's a disturbing and somewhat satisfying scene that leaves you as breathless as Luan by the end of it. <laughs> Number 5. Traveller Ambush Naturally, given that Finn Wallace is killed by Darren, the Wallace's first target for vengeance is the Welsh Travellers. Although Darren's father, Kenny, attempted to sue for peace, it didn't work. Have I got your word that you'll leave my son alone? You have my word that I won't shoot you in the back when you walk away. Sean, Ed and other Wallace gang members arrive at the Traveller's trailer camp with heavy weaponry and fire indiscriminately on everyone they see. While a few of the residents manage to kill or injure a couple of the attackers, most of them die. Kenny manages to escape though, using gas explosions to cover his exit. It's the show's first major firefight, and there are some excellent extended sequences throughout. It also helps cement how utterly ruthless the Wallace family can be. Number 4. Pub Fight While everyone is still mourning Finn, Elliot recognises a man in the video of Finn's driver being abducted as Besmir, one of Luan's men in a nearby pub. Right, Bez. The idea is to take him quietly, but a fight breaks out after Elliot is sidelined. Elliot then goes in alone and quickly works his way through the pub's Albanian thugs with brutal efficiency, armed with only his fists and a dart. The hits are hard and the action beautifully choreographed, as usual for Gareth Evans. <laughs> Elliot eventually gets his man, but only after chasing him down. It's the show's first big action scene, and it certainly leaves an impression. So who would you rather talk to, me or him? <laughs> Number 3. Sniper Surprise Things get tense when Sean's man Mark exposes Elliot as an undercover cop and takes him to see Sean. However, before he can tell Sean, Luan arrives at a meeting to explain his business with Finn and to clear away misunderstandings. Before he can go into detail, a sniper laser appears on Sean and Mark takes the bullet. Sean? Leif, a Danish assassin, fires on both gangs to kill Sean, killing many of them. Meanwhile, Elliot fights free of his restraints and saves Sean's life, taking a bullet in the process. In just a few minutes, the trajectory of the show changes, and it does so in an explosive fashion. Number 2. Sean's Death With Sean in hiding, Elliot goes to great lengths to reach him, despite sensing a trap. He's right, Sean knows he's a cop. However, whilst he's angry, he's also surprisingly decided to share information about the Wallace's backers that could bring them down. When I found out who you are, I wanted to crack your skull open. Then I realised you might be the only way for me to get what I want. That's shocking enough. Sean's confrontation with Alex Dumani soon afterwards is an emotional nail-biter. Alex holds a gun to his head and nearly kills him before Sean talks him down. And just when things are calming down, Elliot takes the gun and shoots Sean himself. It turns out that the mystery investors approached him and threatened Alex's sister Shannon and her son, whom Elliot has grown close with. It's a jaw-dropping moment in a finale full of surprises. Alex Dumani must remain in play. Number 1. House Shootout Kinney sends his son Darren into hiding at a fortified house run by Evie, an arms maker, and her adopted children. Unfortunately, Leif and his fellow Danish mercenaries track him there. What follows is easily the biggest and greatest action scene thus far on Gangs of London. 
the 20 minute sequence has a ton of highlights, from the bloody opening salvo, to the suspenseful rooftop entry, to Mal's incredible sacrifice with a grenade. Darren and Kinney nearly escape on a boat when Evie's husband arrives. However, they are tragically gunned down by Leif, just short of their goal. It's a masterful action scene that's better than those in most films. This shootout will be difficult for Gangs of London to top going forward. Yellow, 246. Yes sir, immediately. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Watch Mojo UK and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.